ladies and gentlemen you are welcome back to lucas trends yes i promised you that today nana agrada will be sent to court and any update from there will be brought to you right on this channel nana agrada was in court today yes and everything that happened is right before me and you are going to have it the hilarious moments and then all the other things that happened in court today nana agrada has been charged with seven counts yes the Ghana Police Service in their statement after the arrest of Nana Agrada indicated clearly that anyone who has anything against Nana Agrada should come forward and lay a formal complaint. Seven individuals were bold enough to go forward and they have laid a formal complaint. And that is what was brought to court today against Evangelist Mama Patricia. Let us get into the story. all right so today nana agada was in court yeah nana agada was in court before we get into the story if you have not subscribed make sure you subscribe to the channel yes if you have not subscribed make sure you subscribe to the channel don't forget like the video as well so nana agada was in court today and <laughs> one funny moment there was one funny moment when the judge mentioned his name uh mrs or madame patricia asidu when Nagada got into the box, Nagada said the particular person that they mentioned her name, that particular name does not belong to her. She is not called Madame Patricia Asidua, but then she is called Reverend Dr. Patricia Asidua. Levels don't change. <laughs> hey, trouble. Like, who gave her that doctor that? Ghana, who gave her that doctor title? Anyway, she has been ordained as a reverend. So, the reverend will give that credit to her. So, she actually corrected the judge that she is not called just raw like that. She has titles, Madame Patricia Asiedua. After that, these were the charges that were slapped on her face. Seven counts of defrauding under false pretense. Yes, that is she. She lied to people that maybe bring this amount of money or be able to double the money for you. So this is this. This is where the scamming comes. And then, Chalan panic advert on TV and newspapers. She sat on her TV, made adverts, deceitful ones. That when you come to me, this is what I can do for you. Bring your money. This is what I can do for you. And then she used all these processes to dupe or to get money from. I don't say innocent individuals, those who are not innocent, and they should also be arrested and face the law for their negligence. Now, these were the seven counsels, the seven individuals who lodged the formal complaint. The first person was Yabema, she is a trader. And then Imano Kumi from a shaman. Hey, now, hard guy from a shaman, how could you be scammed? Next was George Boatse from Obwase, then uh, Grace Forsen from Swedro. Madame Mary Arthur from Takrade and then Patricia and Kama from Sunyani. This one here is nationwide scam everywhere. Hey! So that is the update coming in. Now, this is what actually happened. After everything, the lawyer of Nana Grada pleaded for bill. Before that, Nana Grada pleaded not guilty. Yes, she said she has not done anyone anything wrong. She said in the previous video that it was actually a harvest that they had. And then she had not taken any illegal money from anyone. So she's not guilty. Now, she was denied bill and has been remanded for pori, 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 two weeks. So Nana Grada would be in police custody for two weeks and then she will reappear in court on the 28th of October. Yes, 28th of this month. So Nana Grada was not denied bill. When she got out of the courtroom, she shouted and began to sing. Yeah. 
And her supporters like, hey, Ghana, we get problem. Nanaka has still has supporters, yes. Nanaka has still has supporters, people following her. And then she sang with her supporters how, whilst she was being carried away by the personnel of Ghana Police Service. If you have not subscribed to the channel, make sure you smash the subscription button, like the video as well, so that any update that comes on, you would not miss it. And thank you very much for watching. Peace out.